guys, I'm Charlie, Charlie Big Fanatic. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about five new February releases I am super excited for. The first release I'm going to be talking about is called Traveling with Ghosts. This is a memoir by Shannon Leon Fowler and it's coming out on February 21st. This is a memoir about a woman who goes traveling around the world after her fiance is killed due to a fatal jellyfish sting. She is writing about her travels and her research into jellyfish. She's a marine biologist and her dealing with grief during her travels after her fiancé was killed. I measured this book also in my 2017 debuts. I'm not really interested in jellyfish, I'm going to say that again, but I think reading about grief is one of my favourite things to do. I can't really explain to you why. It's just something that feels so fascinating to me. The mourning period and the feeling of grief and losing someone is just something that will forever fascinate me and I don't know what it is about jellyfish things it's just you go swimming or you go out on a boat and you and this person you're with gets stung by a jellyfish and dies like how random is that? The second book I'm super excited about is Harmless Like You by Rowan Hisayo Buchanan. This book is coming out on February 28th and I already talked about this in my 2017 debuts again so I'm not going to go into too much detail but this is about a woman who abandons her son when he is only two years old. It follows both her son and her in the past. She gets involved in this modeling world because she's friends with a model called Odile and she gets into this destructive relationship with, um, with an older man. And it eventually all leads up to the moment she abandons her two-year-old son. And it goes further in the present when her son is an adult and grown up and how he dealt with his mother abandoning him in the past. Then let's get on with books I haven't talked about on my channel before. The first book I want to mention is The Lonely Heart Hotel by Hedda O'Neill. This is adult historical fiction and it's coming out on February 7th. The cover of the story should remind you of The Night Circus, it says in the synopsis on Goodreads. I think this cover did give me a Night Circus feel. I haven't read The Night Circus but maybe Maybe it's a buzzword word for you, you want to check this out. It's about two orphans who have been abandoned in the winter of 1910. It's about a guy called Pierrot who turns out to be a piano prodigy and a girl called Rose who is gifted in dancing and comedy. They travel around the city performing clown routines and meanwhile fall in love with each other. And they come up with a plan to create a circus that everyone will fall in love with. They are separated as teenagers and both delve into the underworld during the Great Depression. And after several years when as adults they meet each other again and try to make their dreams of starting a circus come alive. And I want to mention the standalone book with the song by S.J. Jones. This is a YA fantasy and it also comes out on February 7th. This story is about Liesl who helps her family in running their inn but then her sister Kate gets taken by the goblins. Liesl journeys after her sister to the goblin lands to save her but the goblin king wants a life for a life to let her sister go. So Lisa offers her hand in marriage to the Goblin King and he accepts so he lets her sister go. But down the underground, Liesl discovers that the Goblin King actually inspires her musically, physically and mentally. But meanwhile, her life is fading away. The last book I want to mention is The Orphan's Tale by Pam Janoff. This is an adult World War II story and comes out on February 21st. This is about 17 year old Noah who has been cast out from a society after becoming pregnant by a Nazi soldier. She's heartbroken by giving her baby up for adoption and eventually lives above a German rail station after being cast out from a native Holland. Noah discovers a boxcar full of Jewish abandoned infants and steals a baby and flees into the night. But she's eventually rescued by a German circus. Again, circus. I don't know what it is, but I really like the circus bros. The circus owner offers Noah to learn how the flying trapeze act. The lead aerialist, Astrid, is Noah's rival in this, but soon they, they develop a powerful bond. Soon enough, they have to discover if their friendship is enough to save both of them. So these are the five new releases I'm excited for in February. Let me know down below if you're excited for any of these releases or what other releases you are excited for in February. I would love to know. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.